Hey guys, it's Ben. Had some good progress this week on the old Honda CB750. As you see, turbocharger is mounted and fitting real good. Charge pipe. Blow off. Goodies down here. Best news is down here on the bottom. Was able to get the pan worked out and there's a drain on there for the turbo now waiting on the fitting and the line so we actually can get the plumbing in but that'll be here soon <clears throat> more parts showed up up here also we now have a kill switch and a start switch so we can turn the key on everything works hit the button headlight comes on and we got power. She's going to start. Back here. Some of the other good news. Did some more fabbing and welding. Gas tank now has two fittings on the bottom. One is going to be for the feed and one is going to be for the return. Because it's going to have a fuel pump with a pressure regulator and all the goodies. So when the engine makes boost, it'll be able to supply enough fuel from here to get into there, make everybody happy. <clears throat> Everything is coming together quite well. Got all the boots for the charge tank on, all the couplers, all the clamps. Everything is fit and perfect, which is always good. <laughs> Turbo is fitting awesome. Tucks in there real nice. Clears the filter housing. Front brake is all worked out now. That's actually a later model brake on a front end that's actually, I think, from a 650. And it sits a bit lower, which is really what I wanted. And the, the rake with the or the, the trail with the axle location is very preferable. And right now I have about, I think it's about 5.2 inches of trail with the, the current rake setup, which it, it should handle like a dream, really. <clears throat> so hoping all this is going to come together real nice because we got a bunch of parts that are supposed to be here this week. But everything, of course, is, you know, moving slow as usual. But we're getting there. Definitely getting there. Wish I had some fuel to it so I could fire this thing up and hear it. I am I am chomping to hear it, especially with the big race cam that's in there. I'm not sure who made the cam, but it is a big lumpy cam. And uh <laughs> I can't wait. I'm so anxious to hear this thing. It's uh it's very close. We are definitely getting there. Most definitely getting there. <clears throat> Once the oil parts show up for the turbo, we should be good there. And then once the rest of the fuel system parts show up, really mainly the fuel pump and the regulator, once all that gets here, we should be good. The wiring is all completed now. This is actually my tax signal wire. So that hopefully I can tell the gauge, I'm using points still. Hopefully I can tell this new digital gauge what the, the rev reference is so that I can actually have a working tachometer also. That's my new challenge. But it seems like it's everything's going to work. I'm just waiting for it. Like once I can start it, then we'll know exactly that it's going to work or not. Made a slight deflector down here just to protect the wiring. <clears throat> just in case there's any chain issues, which I'm not hoping for, but we all know it could happen. Getting very close. Hoping we're going to have maybe fire up very soon because my birthday is coming up and I want to make some noise and go fast on my birthday. I'm sure y'all know how that is. Got to have fun on your birthday. Why not? Later. Hey, like, share, subscribe. More to come.